What are three things that any loan officer or realtor can do today to be successful? The biggest thing I think is look at your database. You know, every if I were to ask a question, how many realtors or loan officers call their past clients, you know, once a year? You know, how many people do you think tell me, well, Michael, I don't call? I bet you 98% of loan officers and realtors would tell me that they don't call their past clients. I met a very successful loan officer once that had a little hourglass and it was a two hour hourglass and he turned it over on his desk and for two hours he called his past clients. Well, let me tell you that loan officer was extremely successful, you know, doing $15 million a month in business. That's huge. So what is the value of calling your past client? They might have a great interest rate. They may not want to move, but they really would like hearing from you. Just ask them how they're doing, what's new in their life. Take some notes, you know, send them on a little thank you card for taking a few minutes on the phone with you. Let them know, hey, I'd like to communicate with you a little bit more often. Is that all right? If they say that's all right, I mean, that's fantastic. What if they knew a neighbor that was thinking of buying or selling and they wanted to give you a referral and they were so happy that you just happened to call them? I would guess that if you call a hundred past clients over the course of just call it two weeks, um, I bet you 10% of those clients would have a referral for you and you might get one or two loans out of it, which would be fantastic. Or as a realtor, you might get uh, referred to a, a neighbor that might be thinking of listing their home. I can't think of a better thing to do right now in order to build your business. That's one thing. The second thing that we can do in order to build our business is we have to meet people face to face. We've got to get out of our comfort zone and wait for people to all of a sudden call us and the phone to ring. That's not going to happen. You need to get out and meet business owners. You need to meet people in places like have coffee with them. Call up a client, call up a realtor, call up a friend, go have coffee. Make sure everyone knows what you do for a living. And the third thing to do is ask for business. Now, not in a creepy way or anything like that, but if I'm a loan officer and I have a realtor or a CPA, even, even an attorney in front of me, I might want to talk about something that a service I provide and say, if you could use a service like this, I would love to work with some of your clients. That's it. It's really simple. Practice these things, write them down, go out, build your business.